Do you want a cute, adorable bunny just like Lion here? Well, stick around in this video so we can teach you a few tips that might help your parents say yes to you getting a bunny. So you wanna get a bunny, but your parents aren't too sure about the idea yet. The first thing you need to do before approaching your parents is to do your research. A great way to do research is to watch YouTube videos and I'll post some links down below of a playlist that you can watch with some great bunny care videos. And also uh, Facebook groups are a great way to get in touch with current bunny owners and people that might be really knowledgeable about bunny care and this is a great place to go to find more information. Um, after you do your research, you're going to need to plan how you're going to house your bunny. Are you going to do an X-Pin, an NIC condo? Are you going to free roam? You need to find out how you're going to house them and what exactly that plan is going to look like. The next thing you need to do um, when doing your research is plan an upfront cost budget and a monthly budget. Decide what exactly it's gonna to cost to get your bunny, how much it's gonna cost each month, and how you plan on paying for that. This will be a great step in showing your parents that you're taking this seriously and that you're ready for this responsibility. The next thing you need to do is to find an exotic vet service in your area. This is going to be a rabbit savvy vet, not your typical cat and dog vet. This will show your parents that you're serious, not only about the fun things that you can do with your bunny, but about your rabbit's overall well-being and health. You need to find out the location of the exotic vet and also you need to find out the cost. If you'd like to save on cost, you can rescue a rabbit from your local shelter or rescue center. This will not only save on your veterinarian costs, but it will also save a rabbit in need. Also, you need to decide who's gonna pay for this. Is it going to be your parents or is it going to be you? And if you're gonna help pay for these costs, how are you gonna do that? So this is definitely something you need to think about, write down before talking to your parents. If you already have a pet in your home, you can do some more research to step up your pet care and show them that you're taking your pet care more seriously. By taking more responsibility for your current pet, it will make them more likely to say yes to getting a new one. The next thing you can do is show your parents that you're being more responsible. To do this, you can do extra chores, try harder in school, do things without being asked, and just choose to do anything that shows your parents that you're ready for this big responsibility. When you discuss getting a bunny with your parents, make sure you do it in a mature and thought out way. Make sure you have written notes with you and discuss each point in detail with them about what you found in your research. After talking to your parents, if they're still not sure or they say no about getting a bunny, it's okay. Politely ask what their objection is and try to counter it with the research you've done. You might even want to show them some videos or some blogs about information that you found on bunnies regarding whatever it is that they're concerned about. Now, if they say it's a concern about your responsibility, simply tell them that you understand but you're committed to getting this bunny. Continue to do all of those things we talked about earlier about showing how responsible you are, including your grades and doing chores. And if you go back to them in six weeks, they might just have a change of heart. Make sure you stick around right now for our 100 subscriber drawing. So guys, today we're gonna to be drawing for our 100 subscriber special giveaway. It is the bag of hay, the homemade treats, the tree jar, and the plushy bunny toy. So we're gonna do the drawing right now. We're gonna have this information posted on our Facebook page if you missed the video. So, Chase Wilkerson Chip and Pancake. That's the winner of our drawing. So we're gonna get with you and find out where we can send your stuff. Congratulations and thanks for subscribing to our channel. Thanks guys and make sure you comment down below if you use these tips to ask your parents for a bunny. Also, don't forget to do all your research before asking and before bringing your new bunny home. Make sure you check out that playlist down below to give you a lot of information that you'll need. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you're interested in more bunny care videos and give this bit video a big like if you enjoyed it. Thank you guys and don't forget to share the bunny love.